Welcome to the final event and episode of Come Lunch With Me, ICHR edition! <laughs> Today, we will count all the points the participants have received throughout our episodes and announce the winner of this season's Come Lunch With Me. Before, let's go and uh, over all of our participants. Contestant number one, Rafael. This Brasileiro Francisinho is the very definition of world citizen, having lived in almost all five continents of the world. He prepared the traditional potato and Roquefort cheese gratin as a secret ingredient. He used passion. Were the judges dancing samba after this dish? Or maybe like the bosa, oh no you didn't. Let's go to the next <laughs> contestant, Joy. Coming originally from Nigeria, this London girl took her roots for a ride and prepared his infamous jollof rice and chicken. Her secret ISHR ingredient is faith and confidence. Will the judges have enjoyed the jollof or not so much of it? <laughs> Next contestant, we have Tom. Coming from God's Own County, Yorkshire, the northern English gentleman prepared his wicked shepherd's pie recipe. His secret ISHR ingredient was resilience. Did the judges eat all, drink all, love doll? Or did they do it for nothing? <laughs> Next up, we have Daura, coming from the most popular Spanish island, this Terenifeña prepared her deliciosa ropa vieja, or old clothes. But don't worry, no actual clothes were actually hurt during her cooking. <laughs> the ISHR secret ingredient she used was the use of languages, or communication. We can say communication, right, Daura? Thank you. Now, did her ropa vieja feel good on the judges, or did they wish for new clothes? <laughs> we'll find that out at the end. We have Martina, coming from Italy's southern region of Puglia. She prepared a buonissima tuna pasta, and her secret ingredient is Eura Defender 2. Did her pasta conquer the judges, or defeated their appetites? We'll see. Once we know the winner of Come Lunch With Me, ISHR Edition. Yay! And now it is time to know the winner of Come Lunch With Me, ISHR Edition. The envelope, please. <laughs> As you can see, all the votes have been counted. And now it is only time to know who the winner will be for Come Lunch With Me, ISHR Edition. special prize of an ISHR wooden spoon is... Martina! Yeah. Martina will receive this special ISHR wooden spoon. I hope you can cook a lot of pasta con el tono. Grazie. Thank you very much. Okay. And now things are getting even more serious. We still have the other contestants that might be winners in this Come Lunch With Me special edition. Will it be the Shepherd's Pie or will it be the Ropa Vieja? <laughs> the second place! And the winner of a shiny ISHR silver fork is... Here you go! You could have many... Like this. Exactly. You could use it as a comb or as a thingamajigger. That is great. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. <laughs> now go, go over there. <laughs> this anxiety is eating us all, I know. Will it be the sure. price that won? Or the ropa vieja? <laughs> so, as the first prize winner and the winner of an amazing ISHR chef hat is a tie everybody between Daura and Joy.
prices because you're very excited about getting the prize. <laughs> so now is the moment you're all be waiting for the crowning. <laughs> the top chef, ISHR, come lunch with me. ISHR edition. Thank you to all the participants. Thank you, a special thanks to Tom and his wonderful Shepherd's Pie. We'll see you next season for Come Lunch With Me. I see the repetition. Are you ready? Three. <laughs> well, I really enjoyed this. Come with us. Come lunch with us. Come lunch with. Come lunch with me. Uh, I really like this. Come lunch with us. With me. That's why I give you a minus three. <laughs> Yeah, that's all like say for instance the first feature is the head like say for instance 250 views something like that and then the last one's the head like Yeah, a very good poser like, but it was a video <laughs> Basically, you said like a lot of stuff and you ended up being, I love the lunch. Exactly. What was that? What was that? Okay. It was really delicious. <laughs>